Welcome to King Cole. I'm Susan and this is Joanne and Hello. today we're going to talk about something very exclusive. It's the King Cole collection but this one's a four ply isn't it? It is. It, it is. is. And this it's is really cool. exceptional because it's we're trying to face this more local. It's blue faced leather with a bit of Afghan cashmere. It's all spun around this area isn't it? Yeah. In the Yorkshire area. It is. It's been spun by uh, Laxton's um, yes. which feel free to google them. They're one of our local spinners. They do a lot of high end yeah. yarns. It's not far from where I live either. No it isn't. Yeah no, yeah uh, so we're reducing our carbon footprint as much yeah. as we can with this yarn you know. Yes. Yeah we have to you start don't you and, and work work from there. The, um, yeah. the books were printed by one of our local printers. Yeah um, and they're beautiful. So they're also quite a, you know a local product. So it was shot on location at Laxton. Yeah. It was then spun printed. There. Yeah, spun there. <laughs> printed at local printers. Um, and it is British Blueface Leicester that is 90% um, of this yarn with the 10% Afghan cashmere. Yes. Um, to give it that, that extra luxury. Um, we've brought 10 colours out so far in the range. They come in the 50 gram hanks. Um, We've started off with a winter white in this. I love winter white. Yeah. I love because like I find so white much. quite bright and I just yeah. find things like an off white or a winter white yeah. just like that. A little bit subtle. It is. A little, yeah. little bit softer. Um, then we have our platinum. No, we don't. What am I on? This is in a different <laughs> order. Somebody's rearranged my order. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I was all organized. <laughs> right. I, and I'm not now. So it's this is sunset. Yeah, <laughs> we'll no we'll get there. No, 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 no they're not allowed to do my that. Order. Yeah. Um, for that one, and then we have a lovely burnt orange. I have to say, I'm rather in love with with that. Well, yeah, the, the, all of them. No, all yeah, of them, they're all that, nice. That one is is a definite favourite. Yeah. Um, then in the pinky one, it's called Mulberry. Um, yes. For for that one, and then. We move on to platinum. Now we've got it now right. We've got to platinum. Yeah, yeah. I'm so, the one that has trouble seeing colours, not yeah, you. No, <laughs> it's, it's like it's not in my order. It's not in the colour palette I originally okay, did. Okay, somebody's been fiddling. Um, and right. then we move on to the darker grey, which is the granite. Um, yeah. For that one, and those two really do complement. They do. One another. Yes. Okay. And this one's the latte. It is. It is. Right. It's a lovely soft brown. It is. It's a nice bonny brown. Mm -hmm. And then evergreen. Yeah. Oh, yep. Fairly self-explanatory. Yes, it is. Lovely, we don't need to explain that. Lovely rich sheen to it. It does. On, on that one. I love that green. Mm. Yeah, there's a cardigan you'll see later in that is. green and it really showcases it well. It and does. teal. Yep. In, and uh, the final one is midnight blue which mm. I think is gorgeous. They're all fantastic colors. Yeah. There's got to be something for someone in there. The you has, know. The yes. I almost want to do stripey just so I can have one several. of each color. <laughs> Several colors. Yes. Yeah. Um, so, right, the book for this one. Um, yeah. We This is called Collection One, and we've got six garments and two accessory designs in this one. They're not easy knits. We'll tell you no. right off the cuff that no. they take a lot of patience. They do. But they're beautiful they and they're detailed. Like this is yeah. fantastic. The first, yeah. well, we don't have the stripy jumper, no. I'm afraid to show you, but I think this is fantastic with all the yeah. detail and the lace knitting, and it's quite Beautiful like loose fitting. And this is amazing. Yeah. Definitely not an easy knit. But I think it would be manageable if you have experience with lace yes. knitting a bit more oh, yeah. Yeah. because it's you're not doing decreases, are you? No, no. Because that's the big um, issue, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, decreases always cause problems. Yeah. But even for experienced lace knitters, decreases. A cause absolutely, problems. we get lots of queries mm. about that. But the, but the textures beautiful. on it are amazing. Aren't it is, they? and it's one. soft too. Yeah. Like you wouldn't think it would be, but I think it must be the Afghan and cashmere that yeah. lends yeah. itself well to this. Yeah, it's one of those where you could just like. Yeah. Sit and stroke the yarn, couldn't you? <laughs> yeah. We sound <laughs> awful. We're always touching need. yarn. We sound like we're strange <laughs> ladies. There, but You'll understand if you like it. If yarn. you're a knitter, you yeah. get it. You get it. So also within the book, um, there's the colour palette there. Yes. So that's just to give you an idea. You've got some washing instructions and care things yeah. on what there. What size needles is it then? Uh, is it 3.25? 3.25 is, is the initial recommended one, but it, can, it does vary actually because yeah. um, there's some quite different knits in here. So not everything is 
is knit just on a 3.25 needle. Sure. And it's 190 meters per skein, if yes. I said it right, because I yes. probably say it with an American yeah, accent. Skein, it is. Yeah. They're at the 50 gram as yeah. well. Um, but so quite good it's, meterage it's, regardless. It's good meterage is, yeah. is that with those. We have this beautiful. Um, so yeah, there's there's all sorts of pictures in here, but we're We we're spend ages to, looking um, at it and admire things. And yes. Now this, this one, one um, the main detailing shown here is for around the bottom. Because yes, I'm going to hold it up so you can see that. Stripes around the edges of the sleeves and the bottom of the jumper. It's um, a ripple effect too, so be patient. Yeah. It doesn't always show straight away. No, you we always get these rows. kind of curves before it starts mm. to do the lovely curves. Yeah, it does. And on this particular jumper, it has like the, a, round. a big neck, no. almost like a cowl. A cowl neck. Collar on it. Um, so it does it does sort of ripple and fold, so do expect that um, yes. when you're doing them. Of course, if you didn't want that, you could just um, knit it much shorter so that it's more of a little stand-up collar. Um, yeah. But you can also knit it completely plain. Um, I like the ripple effect side. though with the stripes. I think that really showcases yeah. what I would plain do. Plain wouldn't show it up so well. No, that's what I would do. Um, I would so, do it like this. So I I think you need colours, but of course Me we have too, colours that work. Yeah, but that's because we like all the colours. We do. Yeah. Now, we've actually got two cardigans here, which are the same cardigan, but one is Gar not plain it's and called. one is knit um, with the colours. Oh yeah, also, yeah, they're all named after local places, so Gargrave is... Um, it's North Yorkshire, it's where my parents live. How do I, I know that? <laughs> yeah. So it's a little village not far from yeah. here. Um, so again, we've, we've kept with the local theme because we just love that. that yeah. Idea. But this is um, asymmetrical. So it's oh yes, the green one shows it even more as mm, well. The buttons don't go straight down the front; they yes. are actually off off to one side. See, this is the beautiful evergreen. I want to show this one because mm. I love this color. Yeah. It's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. But you can see there that it, yeah. you know, it starts. It goes over almost one like side a diagonal. And then works works its way that way. Yeah. So that is definitely a more interesting knit. It's you know it's not just a, a, a blind in front of the TV sort of knit. You do have no, to No you have a to concentrate and especially with four ply and, yeah. and if you do it in a dark colour, not in front of the telly, <clears throat> natural daylight. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I would recommend definitely recording your rows as you're, as yes. you're knitting on the Of course, one. because it's not a straightforward raglan either. It's kind of like no. a combination of raglan and inset. Yes, it's so it's a bit one of those you have to pay attention yeah. to yeah, to get do. the shaping right. So yeah, I I, even though it looks like it's plain stock and stitch, I wouldn't say it's a beginner's knit, no. but it is beautiful mm. and so soft. Yeah. Now the Lovely. next one is actually the per the uh, Oh I got it. Thing. I got it the wrong way mm -hmm. around. Okay, this one's so, quite heavy, so I'm gonna only hold yeah. it a bit. This this is um almost a kimono, kimono. style um cardigan. Yes. And don't be fooled, it does appear rather thick, but you are knitting with two strands on a five millimeter needle. Yeah. Um because we did look this up, we were we were questioning we weren't sure. <laughs> we were questioning this because it didn't follow the standard four ply light fluffy sort of route. Yeah, no, it's a proper um, it's heavyweight jacket. One really is this isn't it, is. it and it's it's beautiful this it is uh, i love all the cabling in the detail yeah absolutely yeah. gorgeous pockets yeah got pockets too lovely wide fronts going yeah, up yeah so but not a tv net definitely not a tv <laughs> net no not something that you'll just yeah mind whip out on a night it would take a bit of time in a perseverance mm -hmm. and here's another detailed one i think yeah. this one's one of my favorites this one does follow the the four ply idea in that it's very light um split sides lots yeah. of texture a bit of cable a bit of something everything yeah great over your summer pants you could either wear a long sleeve t-shirt or a vest top under underneath it either would work depending yeah. on where you are in the country. So we probably need the long sleeve t-shirt don't we here? Yes we do. Um, Who are you kidding? This one's called MC, yeah, another little village yes. near here. MC Steam Railway if you ever um, if you ever get up this yeah. way there's a lovely little steam railway there. Um, but yes absolutely beautiful with that one. Love the split sides. I do. I like everything about yeah. this one. I like the moss stitch, the cabling detail mm. right there. Lots of, of detailed sections going up so again Pay you attention. Need to do a bit of concentrate. Yep. Don't you on that one? But it's beautiful. Yeah. Yep. Um, and then we have the accessories. We do. We We've gone back to the mustard one there, haven't we? Oh, well, yeah. Here we go. Here oh, we I go. love the accessories because I do fingerless gloves because I walk to work every day yeah. and it's half an hour and it's cold. Yes. So I'm a big fan of things like yeah. this and I think these so are adorable. Those are done in the pink, but this is just shown in grey here. Yeah. Um, yeah. These are one skein items. Yeah. So the you, mulberry. Yeah. In the mulberry, that one. Yep. Um, and then. Oh, it does. We show yes, it, here. it shows we these show two. 
Yep, with the little details, yeah. the little shawls. I love how it's done with the decreases up there mm -hmm. to create that. Yeah. Is it one of those where you start at the bottom and it grows? I haven't read the pattern yet. I haven't, no, I don't know on that one, actually. Um, I'd have to look it up. Me I'd too. Look it up. I have a funny feeling, yeah, that you start off at the bottom and work towards the, the top. That one. Don't, don't quote us on that. No, we're just we thinking out wrong. loud. We could be wrong. Yeah. Um, it's just because we're niches, so we're always we kind are. of curious about how things we are. are constructed yeah. and made, mm -hmm. you know. But they are so, gorgeous. Yeah, they are just a lovely little, you know, there's a couple of different ideas of how to wear them within the book. So there's yeah, a little bit yeah. of styling goes on in there as well. Lots of detailed information. The blue um, is really nice too. What's yeah. it called? Midnight blue. Yeah. Pages and pages of information. So, With your notes um, section for people like me yes. who have to put little notes. Yeah, little notes notes section there, abbreviations are in the back and some really lovely pictures of the actual factory. So yeah. we, we did include a few to just sort of show you where these things are, are created and um, it's quite amazing to, to see the factory in, in operation. So um, yeah, we, we hope you like that one. So uh, well, Definitely, because I think they're absolutely beautiful key yeah. pieces and classics. You'll have them in your wardrobe for years, but remember, yeah. hand wash, please. Yes. And dry Shut flat. Left, dry flat. Yes. Um, and no irons, please. Yeah. You no, know? They're, they're definite speciality ones here. There's something that you want to make and plan to keep. Yes. And with it look being after it. a standard four ply, you can use it with other patterns, obviously. Um, I would say with these yarns if you've got a favorite pattern by all means you know yeah but use get your yarn. meterage right because yes. we do get this a lot yeah yeah you do know. check that your meterage is is compatible as well and uh, if you know if it used if you, a if thousand down, meters on the other one that you'll need a thousand meters of this for for the same thing yeah i know that yeah. sounds a lot but it's not actually in knitting yeah because um, it's small and it takes a long time and condenses it down yeah it does. but you know you mm -hmm. can always contact us if you're not sure yeah yeah you can. You can. okay well thank you for me yeah um, oh we, don't yeah. forget to like us on social media we're a bit like <laughs> we're a bit rubbish today upstairs in the brain department i'm sorry yeah don't forget to like us on social media yeah. until next time bye for me yeah and we'll see you in the next one okay bye, bye.